Hey guys, how you doing? This is Rich from Rich TV Live, and I want to speak to you today about Halo Collective. And you can see here, this is their website at haloco.com. You can go there too and learn everything you need to know about Halo Collective. You can learn about everything about their operations, learn about their portfolio, get all their news and all their contact information. And the website is a great place to learn about their cultivation, manufacturing, distribution, and retail. You can also see their global reach. And Halo is having a really big day today. We're going to go through the chart, but I just want you to take a look at their website so you understand why. Because this is a company that is a very fast growing company. Yes, there's a lot of volatility. There's a lot of ups and downs with growing companies, but this is a company that I think has a chance to really make it and make it a long way. And you can see they're also getting, not only are they in the cannabis space, but they're also getting into the entire psychedelics revolution. So two very fast growing industries and Halo is all over both. Now in their recent news on October 21st, Halo entered into a third amended and restated convertible promissory note for an aggregate principle of 15 million Canadian, which means that they will have a lot of resources available at their disposal. Halo Collective on October 23rd completed securities issuance to independent consultants and related parties. And October 29th last week, Halo Collective unveils Bodega as a name for their retail store brand and hires new retail senior vice president and the market is responding in kind. You can find all this information and get in contact with Halo directly through their website and it's haloco.com. Now I'm just going to go through some of their social media. This is their Twitter page. You can follow them on Twitter. This is their Facebook. You can follow them on Facebook. This is their YouTube. We are subscribed and following them on YouTube. This is their LinkedIn. We are following them on LinkedIn and 5,667 followers on Instagram and we're following them on Instagram. Now let's talk about their chart. So Halo did a reverse. A lot of people uh, were wondering why, but the reality is they had way too many shares. So after the reverse, we saw the price go as high as, I guess, I mean, I guess after the reverse, it was as high as let's say $7. And we've seen them go as low as, let's see here. We've seen them go as low as right there about a dollar 34 and when they were going down a lot of people were what's wrong with halo and halo's this and halo's that but when stocks go up nobody wants to complain and nobody wants to talk about uh them when they go up they just want to talk about them when they go down i've noticed this trend with many many traders it's it's sad but it's true um traders you know really don't understand the markets too well and they don't understand that when stocks go down that's when you should be buying and when stocks go up that's when you should be selling well, Halo went all the way down. Instead of panicking, investors should have bought it because you could see clearly what they've done today. They're making a big move up, 16%. So a 16% move up today. Congratulations to anyone who took advantage of this move. As you can see here, clearly trended down and now trending up. So having a nice big day today. The question is, will this continue? And the symbol in America, H-C-A-N-D. So a lot of the same you could see here. In America, they came all the way down from their top, and now they're starting to trend back up from the bottom. So as an investor, love to know what you guys think about this. You could see that this came down, it went up, came down, and now it's starting to go back up again because it was heavily, heavily oversold. Now, if we go to indicators, Let's see if we can show you guys some of the different tools that we use. So when you look at the RSI, you can see that the RSI is coming right off a of bottom. 30 is our buy zone. And you can clearly see it's coming up right from the buy zone in the RSI now currently at 37, which means there's still a lot of room to go. And the CCI very similar coming up from the buy zone. And we can go to the Canadian side very similar. You could see it literally bounced off the buy zone at the 30 RSI, sitting right now around 38 RSI in Canada. And CCI, same thing, bounced off the buy zone and is trending up. Now, if you want to go and look at other indicators, 
you can go and we can build in, let's go to the MACD. All right, so let's see what the MACD says. So I always like to look at the MACD and if this crosses up, that's a very bullish indicator. So it hasn't crossed up yet, but if we see this cross up, that tells me that this is gonna go a lot higher. So we're definitely gonna be watching this. Now, also if it crosses down, that's a very bearish indicator and telling us it's gonna come down. But right now we can see that uh, it's kind of touching and kind of going sideways. So it's about to make a decision. And if we see a cross up, I, I think we will see this go higher. But if we see it cross back down, then we'll see it go lower. This is the one month chart. You can see that it went all the way up, come back down, a lot of investors taking profits, a lot of investors selling, and now it's starting to come back up again. If we look at the one day chart, you could clearly see today that it went up. It's come back down a little bit, but it's having a really, really strong day today. So this is very bullish for Halo Collective in Canada and the United States, having a really strong day today. Now, the question is, will this continue? I believe now that they have done their consolidation, that they have a much tighter share supply. So if we go to the NEO exchange, and Halo Collective is listed on the NEO exchange. We'll see their share supply here. And we type in Halo. There's Halo Collective Inc. And you can come down here and you can see its last sale price was at $2. It closed at $165 last week. It's up now 21% with pretty good volume. 58 million market cap, which I still think is pretty low for this company. And we can see all of their trades. And if you click on here and go to security details, you can find out all the information about the company, company website, phone number, email, all that information is there. And you can read right here, Halo is a leading manufacturer of cannabis oils and concentrates. Halo is a science-driven, integrated business that cultivates cannabis plants and utilizes proprietary technology to process cannabis, to extract oils, and we manufacture concentrates. Love to get the CEO on our show. Hopefully soon we will. And you can learn more about Halo Collective by watching Rich TV Live, going to their website, and just by doing the research and doing the due diligence and learning as much as possible about the company. And you can go to their newsroom and see all the Halo news and media coverage. Go and find out more about their portfolio. Just click on portfolio and you can scroll down and see the long list of brands that Halo is really utilizing to grow. You can go and learn about their financials and investor intro right here on their website, haloco.com. See why thousands of investors are choosing Halo as their cannabis growth partner. So feel free to learn more about Halo and go and click on stock information and you'll see it's listed on the new exchange, OTC exchange and in Germany. All right, guys, love to know what you guys think about Halo. Do you like these prices? Are you buying Halo at these prices? Do you think that this goes higher from here? Love to know what you guys think. Comment on the video. Now, remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. Please do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything we talk about or discuss here on Rich TV Live. In saying that, we do believe that we bring you winners and we bring them to you first. We analyze these stocks. We break down their news, speak to the CEOs, and have a really good idea of what's going on in the market every single day. A lot of people have been talking about Halo. I'm really excited to see them having a nice day today after dropping aggressively. It's always nice to see them come back. So it shows that there are people that believe in the company, there are people buying the stock, and there are people that believe that it's going to go higher. And after speaking to the CEO, I know that they have plans to go to the NASDAQ. So now that they're at these prices, I believe that they are well positioned to make the application to the NASDAQ. So hopefully we can speak to Kieran Sudu soon and kind of get an idea of what their next steps are. Love to know what you guys think. Halo Collective, H-A-L-O in Canada, 
H-C-A-N-D in America, having a big day today. We'll see if this trend continues. Is your boy Rich from Rich to be live? We're bringing the winners and we're bringing them to you first. What do you think of Halo Collective? If you like these videos, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere and subscribe. And if you'd like to learn how to trade, you can join our trading club at richpicksdaily.com where you can learn how to trade and win. It's your boy Rich from Rich to be live and I'm out. Peace.